Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone back to another video today guys. We have an exciting one because we are talking about the Callisto Protocol again. And not only the Callisto Protocol, but why it's going to succeed where Dead Space fails. This is an exciting one guys, so let's jump right into it. I know you guys have probably seen the Callisto Protocol trailer by now. If you're watching my videos, you definitely know about it. And if you know about the Callisto Protocol, you definitely know about Dead Space, or at least you have heard of it. Dead Space was the OG, guys. Dead Space was the game that many people grew up on, that iconic horror game that everyone was so scared to play then, and is even scared to play now. Now, this game stood up to the test of time. It looks so good even this day and age in 2022. But guys, we now have two brand new games, Dead Space again, and the Callisto Protocol. Now, the Callisto Protocol is taking a lot of themes of what Dead Space was and just making it better. It's amplifying it. But why is it going to succeed where the new Dead Space game is going to fail well there's a couple reasons for that but today's video i really wanted to touch on one guys that is going to be the brand new gore system now dead space had an incredible gore system i mean incredible for the time you could dismember limbs you could absolutely take apart enemies limb by limb arm by arm head by head it was so exciting to see you just go at it for hours on end shooting apart enemies blasting beating stomping it was an incredible time but James Schofield has touched on the brand new dismemberment and gore system in the Callisto Protocol, and here's what he had to say. You can be very analytical about it. There's a lot of medical research journals you can happily look up about how limbs are dismembered, and there are studies on how this happens. We wanted to be as realistic as we could in the way this happens. James explained that the Callisto Protocol's gore system is built on three pieces of technology. Dismemberment, chunking, and blood. Dismemberment focuses on how limbs and body parts are removed, while the blood technology handles how it moves and behaves, such as splattering and puddling. Now this is making the game as realistic as possible, while also just being so deadly to look at and so exciting. Chunking though handles the way that individual pieces of flesh behave outside of those larger things. So we researched each one of these subjects and then we worked on the way they interact with each other and that's why when you see something in the game it feels very grounded and realistic. Now Dead Space appears to just be taking a lot of the original ideas from the Dead Space games and just building on them but without really adding anything to it. It's going to be improving the graphics slightly. It appears to be doing a lot of the same things the original Dead Space games were. Now that is going to bring about the nostalgic feel from the original Dead Space games, but 10, 15 years later, you don't exactly want the exact same game. You want to improve on that original idea, that original topic, and that is what the Callisto Protocol is doing by building its own horror elements. It's doing that with a lot of added flair, and we're going to see a lot of exciting stuff in the Callisto Protocol. Now, yes, I know a lot of people are comparing it to the actual Dead Space games and the new one that's coming out, but I think that the Callisto Protocol is taking itself very seriously and trying to make itself a name in this game space. It's going to be the brand new Dead Space, the game that people really ooh and ah at, at least from what we're seeing gameplay wise and from what we're seeing on the trailers. Guys, I have so much high hope for this game, and I really hope I'm not going to be let down by it. I really hope I'm not letting all you guys down by telling you all this information. If you guys haven't already subscribed, though, please, please, please feel free to subscribe, guys. I'm trying to do as many videos as I can in such a short time, and I'm going to be consistently uploading going here on out. So definitely feel free to leave a comment down below on what you guys want to see next. Do you guys want to see me do a lot more in-depth gameplay analysis, video analysis, trailer breakdown of the Callisto Protocol, or do you guys want to see some other stuff? Let me know down below, and if you do want to see some other stuff, definitely feel free to shoot in my way. Would you guys also like to see me do some gaming videos? I can definitely go download some games, do some walkthroughs. I would have so much fun doing that. You guys have no idea, and let me know what you guys want to see. I love you guys. Have a good one. Peace.